All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So today we are going to be taking a look at everything that you guys need to know about the global data download that we got this morning. Now, as always, before we get into it, I want to give a big shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all these assets. If you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. And with that said, let's scroll down a little bit here and start with the assets for the LR Goten and Trunks slash Mighty Mask Extreme Z Battle Event. As you can see, we have the uh, Super Attack line for them. This is the event logo, as well as the Extreme Z Battle uh, Medal. From there, we have a new My Data Category banner, which is for the LR Goten and Trunks Extreme Z Battle Event. And we also have the Doken Awakening, as well as the Extreme Z Awakening for the Super Strike Event Tech Mighty Mask. So here are some assets for him, along with the medals, I believe. Yes, we do. So we have the bronze, silver, gold, and uh, rainbow as well for the Mighty Mask. And last but not least, we have some updated Chinese fonts. So uh, I didn't realize there were three different colors for each language, maybe, but we have some bronze characters, we have some gold characters, and we also have some uh, silver characters. So there you go, updated Chinese fonts, um, Super Strike Extreme Z Awakening for the Tech Mighty Mask, and also a bunch of assets related to the LR Mighty Mask or Goten and Trunks Extreme Z Battle slash Extreme Z Awakening. And that was basically the entire data download, guys. Um, not much more to talk about here, but of course, before we go, I do want to quickly go over the Extreme Z Awakening details for the Goten and Trunks as well as the Mighty Mask for people that missed my video from a few days ago. So uh, let's jump over to the Dokkan Wiki here. And as far as the release date goes for both of the Awakenings, it's going to be April 21st, 2022, or in roughly 14 hours from the time this video comes out. And starting with the AGL Mighty Mask, before the Extreme Z Awakening, leader skill, AGL types, or super AGL types, keep plus 4, HP attack and defense plus 100%, extreme AGL types, keep plus 2, HP attack and defense plus 70%, uh, super attack, 50% chance for either fat go tanks or skinny go tanks, and when you become fat go tanks, it lowers own attack for one turn and causes colossal damage, and for skinny go tanks, it lowers own attack and defense for one turn and causes colossal damage. And then for the ultra super attack, 70% chance for Super Saiyan 1 Gotenks, and 30% chance for Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. For Super Saiyan 1 Gotenks, it causes mega colossal damage and raises defense by 30% for one turn, and Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks causes mega colossal damage and greatly raises attack and defense for one turn. And passive, key plus 3 to 9 randomly at the start of turn, attack plus 120% when performing a super attack. Now with the new Extreme Z Awakening, the leader skill becomes Super AGL Types key plus 4, HP attack and defense plus 120% or Extreme AGL Types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 90%. Super attack, once again 50% chance for fat go tanks or skinny go tanks, and for the fat go tanks, raises defense by 30% for one turn and causes colossal damage, and skinny go tanks lowers own defense by 30% for one turn and causes colossal damage. So you still don't want to get skinny go tanks, but it's not as bad as it was before the EZA. And getting fat go tanks is actually a good thing now. And for the ultra super attack, 50% chance for Super Saiyan 1 go tanks or Super Saiyan 3 go tanks as opposed to 70% and 30% respectively before. And for Super Saiyan 1, mega colossal damage and raises defense by 30% for one turn. And Super Saiyan 3, mega colossal damage and greatly raises attack and defense for one turn. And passive is key plus 5 to 10 randomly at the start of turn compared to 3 to 9 before. And then attack and defense plus 150% when performing a super attack plus an additional attack plus 50% if it is an ultra super attack and medium chance of evading enemies' attacks, including super attacks. So obviously, this is a slot 2 or slot 3 unit because they get no defense whatsoever before they attack. But after they attack, after they super, they actually get very, very tanky. So 
they will be a good slot 2 or slot 3 defender, and their damage will be uh, very impressive. These guys hit extremely, extremely hard with the EZA. So that is the AGL Goten and Trunks Extreme Z Awakening. Now moving on to the Tech Mighty Mask. Uh, since I'm assuming most people will be Extreme Z Awakening these guys, I'm only going to be talking about the post EZA details. Okay, so with the EZA, leader skill is AGL and tech types keep plus 3. HP, attack, and defense plus 70%. Super attack raises attack and defense for one turn and causes supreme damage and greatly lowers defense. And then passive is attack and defense plus 100% plus an additional attack and defense plus 50% when performing a super attack plus an additional defense plus 50% and medium chance of evading enemies' attacks, including super attacks, when facing only one enemy. Plus an additional attack plus 50% and launches an additional attack that has a medium chance of becoming a super attack when facing two or more enemies. Links are the Innocents, World Tournament Reborn, Super Saiyan, Bombardment, Super Strike, Blazing Battle, and Shattering the Limit, and categories are World Tournament and Majin Buu Saga. So overall, a very solid um, free-to-play unit. Definitely not going to be amazing offensively or defensively, but good enough to be a filler on any team that they can fit on, right? So, uh, yeah, that does it for today's video, guys. That is the Tech Mighty Mask and the L Arco Tenant Trunks Extreme Z Awakenings. And that was today's data download for Global. As always, uh, once again, a big shout out to my boy Proton10MG. Definitely go follow him. And as always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.